and welcome back to another video. Today I'll be looking at the dogs that I'm currently eating my dog Lily's just sat on the carpet. Don't know what she's doing, she's just she was looking at me, now she's not looking at me, I don't know why. Um but yeah, anyway. Uh, so I took a, a way back ago, like at the beginning of the, I think it was like literally the second add-on review I did before like the Maga Fleece was even a thing. I did basically did a review of like an add-on like that exp expanded the dogs uh, like massively. Like I did uh, like way more like variants. Like you had her, you had like variants of overworld dog of the regular dogs. Um, you had like um, hellhounds. You had end dogs. You had it just added a bunch of different dogs. It's been so long I can't ex remember exactly what was in it. So, um. It was pretty cool. There's dogs that could fly. So we have the paw pad and the dogs add on that guidebook. Dogs add on. Welcome, uh, follow dog lo fellow dog lover. In uh, this add on, you uh, can adopt dogs, dress them up, feed them, and most importantly, play with them. They can do other things too, like be trained, fight alongside you, and more! You're gonna love it! Check your paw pad to learn how to adopt your first dog. I, it also tells you about all the uh, cool items you can use, and has lots of uh, tips to help you be the best dog partner ever! Okay, so open the paw pad. There's Call Doggo Adoption Agency, Item Guide and Help and Settings. So what settings is there? You must be in creative mode. Ah. Um, one. So I'm guessing this is just like for moderation if you like a realm. Uh, operator. So you can like dog bus. Dogs will sometimes give you temporary effects when you are nearby. So yeah, you can turn these on and off if you want. Dog sounds, dogs will make a barking, crying, digging sounds, etc. Allow a teleportation. Allow any player to teleport to dogs using the paw bar pad. Allow dog adoption. Allow any player to adopt new dogs using the paw pad. Allow a dog surrender. Allow any player to surrender dogs using the paw pad. I don't know. I guess that means send them off to like... Ah. Allow dog uh, renaming. Allow any player to rename dogs. Give paw pad to new players. Automatically give all new players a paw pad uh, tablet. So can you craft the paw pad then? So if I go back to game mode zero and I go into here, can I craft up a paw? Yeah, you can. To craft it, it is dirt around the glass block and lever. Bit odd. So yeah, paw pad. Call Doggo Adoption Agency. Hello, this is Doggo Adoption Agency. How can we help you? I want to adopt a dog. We have many breeds of dogs available for adoption. Which breed are you interested in? So there's Dalmatians, Yorkshire Terriers, Pugs, Cavalier King Charles Spaniels, Dachshunds, uh, French Bulldogs, Chihuahuas, Poodles, Labrador Retrievers, Beagles, Shiba Inus, which it, uh, you'll know better as the Doge, uh, German Shepherd, I actually had a German Shepherd growing up, or well, my mum did, uh, Pomeranian, Golden Retriever, Rottweiler, Bichon, and Bulldog. So there's no Lilies in here because there's no Shih Shihsus or Shih Tzu's or however you want to pronounce it. So I'll go with a Yorkshire Terrier because my father's side uh, was is from Yorkshire. Uh, you do not have enough bones to adopt a Yorkshire Terrier. You need three more bones to afford. Okay. I need three bones. One, two, three. Dog adoption, dog dog. Uh, where was a Yorkshire Terrier? I've never gone past it. Oh no, 
Was I always down here? Well, this one was somewhere else. Anyway, adopt your Yorkshire Terrier. I yeah that uh, so for some reason that sometimes when I log in, it, so this is this would be your username, but for some reason it's changed it to this when I logged in. I don't know why. Uh, sometimes it just bugs out. Does that, but it should say Ghost Pokemon Master. Agree you to care for my new Yorkshire Terrier as best I can. Submit. Congratulations, the agency has accepted your request to adopt a Yorkshire Terrier. Check your inbox for, for your pet delivery box to start uh, playing with your new Yorkshire Terrier. Thank you for choosing the Doggo Adoption Agency. Ah, so here we have the pet delivery box. You right click on the ground, pet delivery box for uh, me. Oh, now you right click, don't left click. <laughs> oh, that was one. So, tame me with collar. His name's Beethoven. Okay. Yay, I have a friend Yorkshire Terry. Is he following? Nah, he's just... Nah, I think he's on, like, Wanda. Oh, he jumped. He's sat. Now he's standing. You can buy magic shampoo in the item shop to change the uh, colour of Doggo. Oh, so there's now my dog. So there's Beethoven, the Yorkshire Terrier. So I can teleport to him. I can buy items. Oh. Oh, yeah, you right click there. So you can get a black ball with string and, and then sack and blue with that and pink with that and red. With that. Mushroom, get your red, why? Okay, that's a bit odd. Why are they using red mushrooms and not red dye? I think that might be a mistake. You can use bones and red mushrooms to get a bone toy. You can get canned dog food. You can get dog treats. You can get uh, black flying discs with feathers. You can get a grooming brush with a stick and string. You can get kibble bag. You can get rope toys. You can get shampoo bottles. Get yeah, magic shampoo bottles. You get creeper dog toy, train trainer clicker, you can get training whistle, you get vit vitamin booster, you can get a different collar for him, for your doggo, or lots of doggo colours. You can get a, a sunshine sticker jacket. Sunshine day jacket jacket, right? So you can basically get jackets for them. Uh oh, that's just leather. And you can get iron arm best for them. Never right best. You can put a rocket and get them a rainbow jacket. You can get Super Pop Hero Cape. And you can get uh, dog bed. Oh, you get dog beds. Oh, so many new things you can get for your dog. You got the dog bowls. Wow, so many things. So. What I'm going to do is I'm going to stop recording right now and I'm just going to do a bunch of uh, trading to get to all this stuff, uh, get at least like one of each item and then I'll be back to show off the items. Alright, I'm back with one of each item. So let's take a look at these. Let's see. Item guide. Toys and training. Balls. Well, they're all the same. Uh, look, buy dogs everywhere. Throw it and your pet will return it. Use regularly to improve your pet's happiness level. Usage, interact. Throw it and your dog will return it. Increase, t increase happiness. Interact with a dog using get your paw pad and select the buy stuff button and it will cost you. Yeah. So, ooh, I have a balls. Yes, here we go, red balls. So you can right click to throw it. Oh look at it, it's adorable. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, you get it? And then he comes running back. Oh, that's adorable. Mm, right. Item guide, toys and training. Then there's the flying discs. Uh, an exciting toy for active play, perfect for catching on the fly. 
Great for outdoor fun, throw it and your dog will return it, which will increase your dog's happiness. So let's go outside and play with a flying disc. And there's a skeleton out here for some reason. Is it dead skeleton? There we go. Yo! He's like, yeah! Oh. So, nah. I, I'm not, I'm, nah, I'm gonna get it. I got it. Bring it back. Here you go. Okay, get it. Okay. Brings it back. Here's your doorbell. Next up is toys and training. The rope toys. Uh, rope toy. A tough and interactive rope toy that promotes health, that promotes active play and the de de dental health. Uh, throw in your dog will return an increase in happiness. Ah. I would play took a war with uh, these rope toys, rather. Uh, where is he? There he is. There you go, guy. And he's off. Yeah. Don't know why this one makes a squeaky noise when it's rope. Right. Item guide. Toys and training. Next we have the tr Creeper Dog Toy. This toy offers hours of entertainment and helps in keeping your pet active and energized. Throw it and the dog will return it to increase dog happiness. Not interested. Oh, that's how we just caught him in there. <laughs> Sniffing. He stopped to sniff the toy. That's cute. Anyway, yeah. Just a cute little toy that you throw. Yep. Now bring it back to ya. Item guide. Toys and training. Next is a training clicker. When the training go uh, through. F the bubbles appear above your dog's head and your clicker to train them. Interact with dog using your paw pad and the select right. Yeah, that's. You see, uh. Where is he? Uh, ah, no. Use the training clicker to soon slash late. Wait for your dog to show a training bubble before using it. Before using the clicker. Okay, so you just have to... Oh, is that it? I don't know. He was put eye down now. Right. I'm I'm not quite sure how you're supposed to use that. Uh, item guide, toys and training. This one, last one. Training whistle. Uh, Blow wants to call nearby dogs to you. Blow tries to send your dogs uh, to a nearby dog bed. I mean, really, dog whistles. Like oh, average, really. Yeah, basically, yes, yeah, it's fun to you. Oh, doesn't have very good. Oh, there we go. The range isn't very good. He's all the way over there. A right click. Okay, yeah, maybe he was like in the middle of an animation or something. I don't know. I've not seen any training bubbles around there. I don't know what that whole like training thing is. Boot. So next up we have canned dog food usage. Place in a dog bowl 
As a hearty meal for your dog. So, hold on, let me see. Do I have a dog bowl somewhere here. Uh, red dog bowl. I place dog bowl. And I put a can of dog food in there. There you go. Oh, hold on, what does that say? Nice way of filling the food, food well. Ensure your pup is well fed. Uh, is key to maintaining their health and preventing sickness. Did uh, you know that uh, tapping a dog bowl can encourage nearby dogs to eat or drink? So, right, tap in, so I click. Oh, there we go. Yeah, so you punch in and they'll eat a bit from there if they're hungry. I guess he's not hungry. Python guide. Food and treats. So that's canned dog food. Yeah. Uh, then you got dog treats. Food. Feed your dog as a healthy treat to reduce their hunger. Treats also increase dog happiness. Dog treats. Maybe they're going to add more than just a dog treat later on. What's going on? You can just give them your treats. No animation played. Then you have kibble bag. Uh, placing the dog bowl as a nutritious meal for your dog reduces their hunger. Yeah, nothing special about it. Yeah. Then we've got jackets and collars, so collars. I assume they all do the same. Cosmetic, keep your dog on fleek and looking at dogs. So you right click them and you can change the dog colour. Oh, and you get the master work. Neat. Right, um, I have the uh, Impenetrable Neverwhite one. It's cosmetic, but it does give a stat boost. Keep your doggo on fleek and looking at dorbs. Add 50 health points or armor to your dog when worn. So, yeah, Neverwhite gives 50. Uh, diamond gives 50. Iron gives 50. And gold gives 50. So there's no point in like, um, crafting it. Uh, so it doesn't really matter which one you craft to get in the same boost, but, uh, I guess this is like, Actually, if you give them a Neverite one, because it's 12 Neverite guts. Uh. Yeah, that Midnight Pup also gives that. Does... Yeah, so all of them gives plus 50 health points. Okay. Oh, clicker. Uh, well, we saw the bubble there, but I just couldn't react quick enough. So put that on them, and now he's got cut. And he says, oh, uh, yeah, nothing's getting through this. Item guide. Next up is dog finisher. So you got the... So I've got the large dog house, I believe. Uh, Furniture place on the floor so your dog can catch some Z. Sadly, does not stop snoring, though. I know, I only got a small one. How do you get a big one, then? Dog furniture. Large. Interact with a dog using the paw pad and stuff. Oh. Did I just miss it? I can see his stats there. Yeah, they're the small ones. Yeah, there's not any big ones in here. 
Oh, you're supposed to be able to craft it? Oh. House. Dog. No. I don't know then. So let's place this here. We have a small dog house. Next up is the mat. Place on the floor so your dog can catch some Z. Sadly, he does not stop snoring. So, yeah. Basically, yeah. Basically, the same thing, but small. Uh, and not that. Item guide. So we got the grooming brush. Brush your dog to increase their cleanliness. They also love uh, being brushed, so it will make them happy too. Brush. Uh, you brushed your dog. Great job keeping your pup clean and healthy. Remember, dogs need regular. Grooming to keep their fur healthy and shiny. If you don't groom your dog often, they might get sick. There's a lot of things you want me to do. <sighs> then you've got shampoo. Use on your dog to make them squeaky clean and free from fleas. There's a little animation. And you got the magic shampoo, which you use on your dog to change their fur colour. So if I get the magic shampoo here. Ah, so it just rotates. Between some. Item guide. Health and wellness, vitamin booster. Use on the entire. Use on your dog to instantly resurrect them instead of waiting for revival. Alternatively, use it to max out their stats, happiness, health, and hunger. So you can just. Uh, it does not require vitamin. Yeah. These sign. Yes, uh, the only, I think, yeah, it didn't sh it, wait, it didn't tell me about the, this classy dog bed, which is small. And it didn't tell me about this bone toy. Wait, Bay Evan, you gonna uh, get the toy? Yeah, you got it. Uh, let's give him some kibble. So yeah, this is really cute. Um, like I said earlier, it does seem like it, uh, it does make it to, like, um, as I said earlier, it does seem like it is a bit of a, uh, you know, God, no, I can't do words right now for some reason. It does seem like it makes a, makes having a dog a bit more of a, you know, have make them ha have more upkeep, which kind of go kind of bad. Like, you know, you've been... Uh, uh, watching this video, you can tell for yourself if you think this is a good add-on or not. Um, let's go uh, have a look at some of the other doggos that's in here. You're gonna come up, up silly. Come on then, good girl. You're gonna come here. Come on then. So I'm gonna curl up right here. Yeah. Alright, doggo adoption agency. Probably not going to look at all of them, just a few of them, so let's take a look at a King Chevalier Spaniel. Uh, uh, Don't know why it plays the eating noise when I put the collar on it, but he's cute! Look at it! 
Oh, it's Jobo. Uh, Doggo Adoption Agency, Doctor Dog. Uh, let's take a look at the German Shepherd. German Shepherd, yes. Submit. Okay. I did remove that uh, item from my thing. It didn't delete the item, thankfully. Oh, dug out. A bit small, I don't know, but yeah. We'll go adoption agency, adopt a dog. Chihuahua, Chihuahua. Submit. Okay. Yep, yeah, that looks like a Chihuahua. I don't like Chihuahuas, so I'm going to. Oh, you can change the name there. Uh. Well. Dog status, yeah, you can read that if you want in your enter. If I go to here, my dogs, who said I don't like chihuahuas, so if I surrender him, are you sure you want to surrender Bruce? Use magic shampoo instead of uh, surrendering if you just want to change a dog's colour. You will find a new, we will uh, find a new home uh, for your dog. You will not be able to get Bruce back. Continue. I want to surrender Bruce. One thing you cannot undo this. Do not surrender other players' dogs. If you share a well, that would be kind of rude. And he's gone. No animation, he just teleports away in a puff of purple particles. Bruce the Chihuahua left your world. So yeah, pretty cool. It is cool. I do like it. It's one of the more expensive one uh, add-ons, so I think it was like five quid. So it's, I'm kind of like if it was a little bit lower, then I would definitely recommend this. But for like, because like I said, it's uh, it's like more than I can't remember exactly. I think it was more than five quid, pretty sure. But yeah, it does add a bunch of new doggos, and they are cute. They do have some cool animations, which is like. Mm, is this really worth like the five quid? Like compared to like the other stuff we've seen on the marketplace, it's been like I'm a bit iffy on it. Um, but it is it is pretty cool. So I'm gonna say, you know, well obviously like you've seen like what the add-on has to offer. So if you uh, that you can decide whether or not you think it's worth it, and I'm kind, I'm kind, my personally I'm kind of iffy. So I can't wholeheartedly recommend it, but you know, if you love dogs like I do, then it might be worth it to you. Uh, but yeah, hope you guys all did enjoy this video. Hope to see you guys in the next video, and bye bye